How goes it, Android fans? It's me, the Cool Loser, and today's video is going to be in the best games of the week, so let's do it to it. And you know how it goes with the best live wallpaper of the week. It is called Samurai Runner. You can see that's running through a field and you see trees and bamboos and the sun in the background and nothing to the touch though, but that's all you really get to see. It looks really good though. And obviously I'm not using my normal background. You see that? Kind of like my old ways. Just to see how this works out. None of this is final. Alrighty, let's get it on with the best games of the week now, shall we? And I'll start it off with Defense Zone 2. Press begin. And you will see that we got different missions, areas that we can play to unlock. Keep it on two, medium, and let's press play. Power defense game, as you see right here, you got footsteps of where they're gonna cross through. You can zoom out, you can see the full screen, and zoom back in to see more of the detail. You got one wave 20, and you speed up, and your options there, and your pause, and that's to get the game going. So what I gotta do is drag out. And you can see building money is up here, 140, so I can still set. And it's building. Complete. If we're ready, just click on there. And you will see it do its work. That was one wave, and the next wave will start in 10 seconds. You're gonna have to remember that a lot of them are gonna get through. As you see right there, these ones are all gonna get through very bad. Your health, which you can only lose 20, and I'm gonna lose all those real quickly. You can continue on and make your score a lot better than last time if you go into the old one. You will see that you'll be able to unlock new weapons. As you can see, that's the radius of what they get to attack in. Tap in on this guy. Upgrade. Pretty cool game, you're really gonna go like it, go try it out for yourself. Next up we have Rise of the Blobs. Like usual, you'll see different areas to unlock, and then you will see that you got a whole bunch of different stages you'll be able to play through. Stay in the island. And as you see right here, we got a orange coming down, so I'll have to color coordinate it. And then I'll have to tap on it. So it's like a puzzle type of game, you'll see the effects go out and make sure it hits on the right. You can swipe down to hurry it up. You don't have to hit it every single time, but you would want to, you know, make them go away. Don't let it hit the very top because that's where you will lose. You will have specials to use as well. And you see it, it keeps rising. I put it on the wrong spot. That's what happens. Not much to explain other than it's a little puzzle here. It's about how far you get. And then you got this little special bomb here that will help you out to destroy the... Let's see, do this one. See that? And then it goes to the next waves, and then look how much faster it's already getting. See here, I got different little areas here to unlock to add more for more specials. It's pretty cool. Go try it out for yourself. Next up, we have Starry Nuts. Although this has a Christmas theme, it's still fun to play even though it's not Christmas time. You'll be able to practice if you want to learn how to play or jump into play and there's a survival mode. The mission that we can read and go through. Here's a little glowy thing and they've got a slingshot. You're gonna notice different kind of bats and obviously these guys have like little shields there. And don't let them take your... And then you pass and then you can shoot up for these little coins that come up. And you go to the next wave. Moving on. Nope! Ah! And I lost. So you gotta get as far as you can. You can go to the shop area. You can upgrade your slingshot, increase reload speed, and go to the bullets and choose what kind of shots you wanna see. Like you can choose Halloween, there's this on, there's the snowballs that come with it, and the slingshot, choose different colors, and power-ups. It's a pretty cool game. You go to the survival mode just to see how far you can get. And there's your skill parts area. Help you out by pressing some of these. But that's how it's gonna be played, so go try it out for yourself. Next up, we have World at Arms. Now here's a game to build like, your little structure area. You can see, I haven't been playing it for too long. This lady will tell you exactly what you need to build and what to upgrade. And each building does something different. Collect different things there. You see the promotions. You got your little tanks and everyone's secure in the little section. You can go into your quest, tap in here. Go in there and choose ready for duty. 
set something down right there. Quest complete. And you see you'll keep upgrading the further you get. Clicking up here in the tools, you'll see that you can buy a whole bunch of different things. Go into the campaign and choose where you want to battle with people. Areas, clicking on there, press execute. And I'm gonna battle with enemies and I can also play online with people. So right now you can see the enemies are right there. That's what's really cool about this game. Choose how you want to have your people. You see the blue is where to set. So now let's press start. And now the mission is going to go on by itself. And then we'll fight it out. Depending on how you played and how you picked your characters. These are your bad guys. As you see the firing back. And collect these right here. And victory. And you'll see more stuff there. It's a pretty cool game. Go try it out for yourself. Next up, we have Zombie Juice. Just click on play. Choose different levels. Let's go to urban. Go into the survival mode. And you see it's going to count down right there. So what I got to do, don't let them get past the fence. So I got to slice them. And you see we got different power-ups there to help us out during the mission. And, you know, just slice. Right now it's very easy, but don't slice the dogs. So obviously they're going to be running around and they're going to get in the way of you slicing. So it makes it a little bit harder for you to, you know, get all these zombies. I did notice that on my tablet, the game doesn't fit inside the screen. One of the first games that has happened. But let's hit here a dog if I can. And... Then we go to the next stage right here. So now we got a bed and someone's hiding in there and I gotta protect them. If I hit a dog, watch what happens. He turns to big and he'll attack straight to the fence and I can't do anything about it. Pretty cool, it's fun. Go try it out for yourself. Ah, look at that. It's getting all crazy now. Oh. Next up we have 3D Space Golf. Go into play. Course to play, hole in one, challenges and mini golf stars. Go to course play. Let's go into Venus. You got your arrow here, you can adjust. The faster you swipe to the left, the faster to move or to the right. Hitting the ball right here. And we get a meter. And we can hit it whatever capacity we want it to. And there it goes down the tube. And let's see where it lands now. Oh, and there's the hole. So I have to wait until it completely stops. And Go to the next level, and you will see the levels get crazier. Like best way to get the ball up, see if I can get it with one hit. Ah, almost made it. And as you can see here in this world, I have to climb up all these little things there. So, oh no, oh, barely made it. Let's give it a good hit there. And oh, 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 almost. And this is how the game's played, so go try it out for yourself. Next up, we have Little Things Forever. It's actually really fun. 97 puzzle pieces to find. And we'll start with one little section. And what I gotta do is find the ping pong paddle two times, high heels, tractor, and candy cane. So I gotta look through all this little fish little thing here and zoom in if I have to, if I need to, and find what the items told me was. Not a ping pong paddle, so it's timing you. You gotta find it. As you see, it's all well organized. Okay, we can find one ping pong paddle. Because the colors will throw you off. Do you guys see it? Why can't I see a ping pong paddle? And I have to find two of them. Easy for the candy cane. It glows where I last checked it and it'll check off. There's one high heel. I'm like doing the worst time ever. If you have trouble, you can click on hit. And it'll tell you where the area is gonna be at. And if you take too long, it'll keep hinting in closer. And there's the paddle, I see it. There's one. <laughs> Game is really cool. Every time you finish the level, it'll swarm through. It'll give a cool effect into the whole entire thing. Because this is one piece of the whole entire puzzle. And it just looks real cool, guys. Go try it out for yourself. Next up, we have Puzzle Twist. This game's unique. Let's play main menu. And then we'll see how to play. Rotate the playing field. And there's the hint. As in, it'll tell you the first few times of how you're going to set it up. So you got to make the picture of this right there that's the image b you will take a little bit while getting used to like you imagine the yellow is right in there so kind of keep it and somewhere around there. there you go and there's your time so you got to get it 
and at the quickest time as you can. The position that I'm holding it is not the best, but you see there is something like this. There you go. And my time and my scores are up there, so... And every time you get one down, you get extra time. So it doesn't matter if it's upside down or not, as long as you match the blocks to fit in good. Uh-oh. You see the timer's running down, counting down for me. It's close, it's close, it's close. Not bad. And then it adds extra time on top. Ooh, 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 ooh. I know I'm close, I know I'm close. Ah, oh, and time. And there's my scores. Post a score, play again. It's pretty cool. Go try it out for yourself. And last but not least, we have Zombie Age. It's going to resume. I hear you can have different items here to buy new guns, new weapons, more, more items, and then buy different crews. Let's jump into the door, and here I am in day eight. I got a reward, and there is my little power up there. So what I gotta do is shoot these guys. Kind of easy, but then it starts getting really hard tapping. Gotta switch weapon now. And it's going to the direction of your finger pointing. Now switch weapons. Grenade. Whoops. See that? To help you out. So you see this little icon right there? That's actually telling you how far it is to the finish. Collect these for extra bullets. Can we go? And there's the finish for that. And then you'll be able to go into the rankings and see what happens. Rank up, you know, go into the booklet. You can see what happens and reports are coming in that the whole world is under attack by the Walking Dead. It is absolutely not a joke. As you keep getting further, you unlock different things. You see there's that, and I haven't gotten there, so I need to get to 14 to unlock new characters or whatever. Pretty cool, Leo. If you like it, go try it out for yourself. And there you have it. These were the best games of the week. Brought up Google Play. Brought to you by me, the Koo Loser. And as always, please rate, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to spread the word of the Koo Loser. Like I said, this is not permanent, guys. I just wanted to try this out. Just And you're looking at me playing with my Nexus 7. And I'm plugged into an audio cord right here so you guys can hear the games as I play. Some people ask me, is this worth getting? Of course it is. Way better to play my games on here than on my cell phone. That's why I do them all on here. It's running a quad core. The screen quality is actually really good. You get your ports right there and your micro USB there. Speaker right here on the bottom right here. Soft touch feeling. An overall quality product by Asus made for Google, which is a Nexus device. Now, if you're thinking about getting one of these, I highly suggest it for $200 for the 16 gigabyte or 250 for the 32 gigabyte. I have the 16 model. Clicking on the left will take you to the playlist of all the best apps. Clicking on the right will take you to the best games of the week playlist. Subscribe button. Don't forget to like my video. And that's pretty much it. I shall see you next time for the best apps of the week. Later.